Okay, so today we're gonna to go with just some real basic wrestling and takedown stuff for your BJJ and no gi game. So we're gonna start with a collar elbow tie up. And from here, we're just gonna practice two variations of a duck under. First one I'm gonna do is with this hand that's on top here, I'm just gonna pry the elbow open. I'm gonna level change, step, head up, take the back. So again, key points is making this light. Now you can put pressure down on him, hoping that he'll try to resist and bring pressure up. That will make it a lot lighter for you. The level change, start working towards the back. So in real time, I'm here, back under, take the back. One more time, back under. Take the back, adjust your grip. Another version is if maybe he's riding quite low or he's just quite strong and he kind of knows what I'm gonna go for, a little bit more leverage. I actually learned this from my Roman Greco grip. From here, I put my hand on the inside, rest my hand on the shoulder, step through, drive up, perfect posture, take the back. From here, hand on the shoulder, another key point. Take a slightly posture with his head, lift, step through, and pull it in back. In real time, maybe I'll go for the duck under not working. All right, here. One more time, it hasn't worked. Okay, so this time we've entered the um, the, the coronel elbow tie and we're going to go for the Russian 2 one. So from here, the key points to remember if we're going really, really basic is without my hands in the way, I'm trying to get rid of his grip. My shoulder is going to be a big part of getting rid of that grip. From here, I'm going to release the tie I've got in his neck, grab his wrist. This goes underneath, I turn, and I go heavy onto his arm. That allows me to control him and put his legs wherever I want them, okay? Yes, he feels pressure on the elbow, but it's not about trying to get a submission. It's about making him heavy on his legs. So from here, Heavy on the legs. One more time. Heavy on the legs. 